Powerful Hurricane Earl was spinning toward the East Coast today, driving tourists from North Carolina's vacation islands and threatening to bring damaging winds and waves all along the Atlantic seaboard through the Labor Day weekend. Visitors took ferries off of Ocracoke Island and were told to leave neighboring Cape Hatteras in North Carolina's Outer Banks. And federal authorities have warned people along the coast to be prepared to evacuate if necessary. Earl's effect on the East Coast will depend on when it makes its expected turn to the Northeast. But Nassau County Executive Edward Mangano said today it's important to be ready no matter what. Uh, it looks like we may escape this uh, hurricane, but it's a great exercise to make sure that you are prepared to leave your home on a moment's notice. Remember, we live on an island, and it's very important that uh, you stay focused and be prepared. Mangano says the county website is a good place to find the latest information. There's a host of information on there. I really encourage you to listen to the media, look at our website, and uh, remain vigilant. A later than expected turn could mean the storm makes landfall on the eastern extreme tip of North Carolina as a Category 3 storm late tomorrow or early Friday. Thank you.